think you guys have any idea how excited I am to be vlog <laughs> vlogging again. First of all, if my voice sounds a bit weird, it's because ever since I've spoken to you last, I've been in Ho Chi Minh City for a couple of days, and then I moved on to Da Lat, which is another city here in the south of Vietnam, and I was not prepared for the drop in temperature, like literally. It was so cold. My voice is a bit sore, but we will work it out, it's fine. I'm here in a train now in the south of Vietnam, just went to the gym as you saw, and yeah, got a shower, and now I'm just about to get ready. It is my first full day here, I got here yesterday, and I am really, really excited. I had a very good time in Ho Chi Minh City. Unfortunately, I didn't vlog it. And I say unfortunately because now that I look back at it, I had such a good time and I wish that I vlogged it, but keeping it for the memories, I guess. I did not vlog when I was in the lab because it was super local and I just felt like I didn't really feel like it, so that's why I didn't. But now I'm here in the train and I'm so ready to vlog again. And I'm really excited. I kind of miss doing it a lot. My voice sounds so weird and there's echo in here because it's the bathroom. But um, yeah, I'm currently staying at this hotel here in the train. And it's so nice. I'm staying here for a couple of days before I move up to Hoi An but for now I'm happy to be here we got here yesterday as mentioned and I just instantly felt at home sounds weird today I plan on spending the day in the train city I'm gonna go and check out some of the popular monuments attractions etc and have some nice food my boy I'm so excited to sound normal again my camera just randomly passed out hope it's okay <laughs> pray for it I didn't even mention it's fun because it's my first like proper vlog from Vietnam in general and I love it here guys, I can't even explain it to you. And I've heard that the north is better than the south and now I'm starting south and moving my way up north so it's just gonna be better and better. I'm so excited, I can't really explain it to you, it's so real to be here. But yeah, I'm gonna get proper ready now and get changed of course, then head out for a very traditional breakfast which I've been eating every single day since I got here and it's now day 6 I believe, which is mental, but let me show you. having my breakfast at this very 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 local place they did not even understand what I was asking for so I had to show them a picture from Google they gave me the wrong thing but hey it's an experience and yeah that's why I'm here I'm not sure if you guys can hear what I'm even saying I hope you can but yeah let's just move on with the day <laughs> you in the background I'm literally like in front of you <laughs> it's currently 2 p.m. and we just got back and we've done a lot today already went to those temples which were super great they did not let me inside the actual temple as mentioned because I did not wear proper clothing but we did see it from the outside and it was beautiful got back now and I just stopped quickly at the pharmacy because I need to get some of these plasters right here I have a huge wound on my leg that I need to take care of so that's just great bought myself some more conditioner for my hair as well then got myself something which is a bit more exciting because we thought that we wanted to go to the pool now because our hotel has a pool later on we're gonna do like a bit of more some self-care kind of stuff so I bought myself this face mask right here it says that it's with Japanese yuzu but it looks like pomelo on the package I have no idea what it actually is but we're gonna do it a face mask later nonetheless but for now we're gonna head to the pool relax get a dip wash off my sweaty body in the pool and just yeah enjoy the day here
truth is I'm scared cause when I see you coming All I wanna do is tell you that I love you I know you're better off without me Cause your tears stain out Make it dark out when you're around me Like a needle lost in the sand The ink dried in my hand Something could pull so good. Now let's do this face mask thingy Whatever it is Smells a little bit funky. Don't think I opened it correctly. I. Oh my god, I thought it was like liquid, but it's actually a sheet mask as well. They scammed me, I think. <laughs> Ew. Okay. I, 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 I. You're so weird. <laughs> and then you're supposed to take the top off like this? Oh my god. I don't think I've ever looked this unattractive in my entire life. <laughs> oh well. I'm gonna look gorgeous in 10 minutes then. Oh hey. I can taste it. Very good. I see. Guess who accidentally took Tabby's keycard? So you sat in pitch black dark for two hours or something. Ah, one hour ish. Yeah, I did that. Well. Oops. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry. Me and Megaline, we just went out, randomly chose to get our nails done at this nail bar. I got my feet and toes, whatever. And let me say that after six weeks here in Southeast Asia with walking and walking and walking, that was needed. And I got myself a little free cracker as well, or they gave me. It's smushed now, but it's free, so we'll have it anyway. Oh my god, it tastes like took took crisps. Do you know them? Oh, we have them in Denmark. If you know, you know. They're so good. Mm. Today has been really, really good. And we are gonna head out for some pho in about an hour's time-ish, I believe. Need to chill for a bit. But yeah, just enjoying my time here. And tomorrow, we have the best thing planned ever. I can't really say much more, because I think I'm gonna vlog it as well. So I wanted to keep it not a secret, but... A surprise. Let me just say that we're going to the real Vietnam, that's what they say. It's gonna be an authentic experience and I'm really excited for it. But for now, time to chill for a bit before it's time for dinner. Because I've been out all day today. I'm the shark type, so calm down. You know I can stand it. The screaming, I don't get it. Always so damn angry, you the shark type. You can't stand it either. The screaming, and I added way too much spice so my lips are on fire but it's good it's healthy they say so we have a big channel for the whole meal